All right, guys, here's part two of today's workout. The idea was one minute of each exercise with half a minute in between. And I knew that on none of these, uh, I would be able to just rep out for an entire minute. These are all fairly difficult exercises. First one here is feet elevated ring rows. Now, I think I managed 14 here, which is nowhere close to my max. There, as you can see, I kind of failed that rep. So instead of doing a bunch of crappy partials, I decided to just hang in an active position from here. So my lats are still engaged. Shoulder blades still coming together as hard as I'm able to. Still pressing my feet into the ladder. Alright, so. Next one's going to be push-ups. And again, guys, like last video, I decided to uh, cut the audio into a voiceover because I was using my phone as a timer. And that made the timer insanely loud on the video. So I didn't want to deafen anybody with that annoying timer noise, so. Here we go with the voiceover, and here we go with the push-ups. Doing these wide and with sort of a neutral grip. Okay, trying to go as deep as I can. Get a nice stretch in the chest there. Coming back up into the middle, sort of like a fly. I would call this like a wide push-up chest fly combo. Uh, and these feel great on the chest, on the rings. Again, guys, I'm not 100%. Uh, I still tested positive for COVID today. So my symptoms are practically gone. The only thing I really have left is the brain fog a little bit. Though that is getting better. And also a little bit of a scratch in my throat. Still a little bit of an itch. So after 10 push-ups, decided to hold a support hold at the end. Instead of doing shitty partials, very challenging. Now the next exercise, I did not film. I thought about taking the camera with me, but I realized I had not enough time to do so. So, <laughs> did not get this on film, but it was basically pull-ups in between the trees, the way I have it set up. I was so tired, I could only do five pull-ups. <laughs> and I just did an active hang the rest of the time, which even that was kind of hard. And here I go with dips, two crummy reps, and a static hold at the top. And I'm just already destroyed at this point, guys. My endurance is complete garbage. But can't really help but been sick for the past week, so, you know. Better than nothing, guys. This is a starting point that I will take. I'd rather be doing this than being sick still. And there I couldn't even hold <laughs> the support hold for the remainder of the minute. I had like 12 seconds left on the timer, I believe. Um, but that's okay, guys. Gotta start somewhere. Now after this, I went back to those rings in between the trees, the, the high rings. Inverted myself, you know, upside down to do some partial curls to my hips. And similar to the dips, I can only do two repetitions of that. And then I just hung upside down, you know, with my hands by my hips for the remainder of the time. Which felt pretty good, actually. <laughs> I kind of want to kind of want to spend more time upside down. I feel like it kind of released something in my back. So that was pretty cool. Now last exercise here. Uh, ideally would be wall assisted handstand push ups. But I was destroyed at this point. And man. I could barely even hold this. You know static position. And my posture. My core was like tired. I was kind of losing uh, structural integrity <laughs> in my body. 
if you will. So I didn't even make the entire minute here because my, my ribs started to kind of separate from my pelvis and I didn't want any kind of, you know, harsh lumbar spine extension. I do have those back issues, so I didn't want to exacerbate those by hanging out there too long. So I quit while I was ahead. And that's pretty much it, guys. Pretty good workout for day six of COVID. Now after that, I did a little bit more for grip. I didn't uh, film it, but I'll go ahead and tell you what I did for the heck of it. Uh, I was on that one minute interval today and I just it felt good, so I kept doing it. So I did one minute uh, holding 20 pounds with the 3.5 inch pinch block. Okay. So just 20 pounds, you know, just holding it on my side as hard as I could. Right side, then left side. My left side almost failed. <laughs> I mean, you, when you're holding something for a minute, you know, even 20 pounds is quite a lot. And I'm pretty sure, you know, I don't think I've tested my max hold on those, but I know I've held a, uh, what would I call it, like a tabletop position with those for about 20 seconds. And that's about half my body weight. So that would be about 40-ish pounds in each hand. So if I could hold 40 pounds for 20 seconds, I would probably guesstimate <laughs> that I could do maybe 50 pounds for just like a quick brief hold, you know, enough for like a lift, like psh, off the ground, back on the ground. Maybe I'll test my max on that eventually. Maybe I won't. I don't really care that much. But uh, yeah, so 20 pounds for a minute each hand. And then I brought out the dang sledgehammer. Do I have that? Yep, there it is. Boop. I need this thing in a while and just held that um, on my side and just cocked my wrist up like that to get that kind of... Uh, radial deviation work, if you will. Um, don't mind the dog toys over here. He just held that hammer, you know, sort of like halfway or so up. Well, not even halfway. I would say maybe like a fourth of the way <laughs> up the handle. Um, we used to get kind of like a radial, you know, burn in the uh, forearm there. We're on that wrist action I feel, feel, I feel weak in this kind of position sometimes so I'm starting to work on my wrist a little bit more so I did that for one minute as well then I went to the side office where I have all my grip tools and the rice box and all that and put my hand in the rice box and I just did kind of like open and close in the rice box for a minute both hands so that was my entire workout Pretty good, guys, for somebody who had COVID, uh, still has COVID, actually. I'm still testing positive, even though I feel pretty normal. Again, throat is still a bit messed up, but no fever in the past, like, two days. Um, a little bit of a brain fog still. Such an odd symptom. I kind of feel like I'm high all the time, but, like, not in a fun way. <laughs> uh, I just kind of feel like I'm, I'm stupid or something. Like, haven't slept well or something, you know what I mean? You were, you were, like, not sleep, and the next day you're just, like, an idiot. And that's how I feel, like, all the time with this COVID brain fog. It kind of sucks ass, but uh, it is what it is. It's getting better, too, I think, so that's good. But that's it, guys. Uh, tomorrow, probably going to climb. I mean, not at the gym, but just climb around the house and do some, like, fingertip exercises here and there during work. I may or may not film those. We'll see what's up. Um, it's not going to be anything impressive, obviously. I'm kind of out of shape right now. But it is what it is, man. I'm exercising again, and that's all that matters to me, man. I'm feeling good about that. Y'all take care. Peace.